What is up, YouTube? This your boy Dirty Jers HD. <laughs> Bring you guys a little search and destroy raping gameplay slash semi rushing gameplay with the Enfield suppressed flak jacket sleight of hand ninja. I believe my final score is eleven and one. I know I gave it away. Shit. But, what I want to talk about in this game, play, <laughs> is my favorite Call of Duty of all time. Now, if you go down the line, COD 4, you can pick and choose. Well, you can pick and choose about every Call of Duty, like what you don't like, what you like. But, to make shit simple, COD 4... There's nothing really overpowered in that game. There's no one-man army shit. There's no... None of that... And, I mean, the camping, I, I've never really had too much trouble with the camping on that game. So the camping on that game is definitely not a problem for me. No UMP-45. <laughs> now, I had to... I think World of War came out in 2008. Treyarch's first big Call of Duty game in my eyes. That game was awesome. I liked it, but there was... I guess there was one big problem in that game. The MP40. <laughs> I mean, if, if they didn't have the MP40, or if they would have nerfed it somehow, and kept up-to-date patches on it, then that game would have been fine. I mean, yes, it got a little old, of course... They're not going to go crazy on patches when the game's fucking four years old. But if they would have nerfed the MP40 like they're doing to the FAMAS and stuff in Black Ops, I think that game would have been a lot more successful. So, my problem with World at War was the MP40. On to Modern Warfare 2, Infinity Ward's second big Call of Duty series game in my eyes. Tons of problems. Very good game, but it had tons of problems. One man army, where you can sit there in a corner, unlimited fucking noob tubes, camp your ass off, get fucking nukes, which takes no skill at all to get a nuke. No skill. And the UMP 45, which is like the MP 40, basically. You, <laughs> you don't have to be skilled at all to use that gun. Uh, some of the kill streaks in my eyes were overpowered, like the chopper gunner and stuff. I think that, I don't know if they patched that sometime through that game, but I'm pretty sure they might have nerfed the chopper gunner or the AC-130. But in my opinion, the fucking AC-130 blew ass. I mean, <laughs> it, it was a lot easier to get. Like, say you had a 7-Eleven, 7-Eleven. You want Slurpee and beef jerky with that? No, but say you had a Harrier chopper gunner nuke or Harrier AC-130 nuke. In my eyes, it's a lot easier to get for, go from that chopper gunner to that nuke if you were using the chopper gunner. The AC-130, I mean, it was good on certain maps, but... I mean, I don't know. I'd, I'd prefer the chopper gunner. So, big problems in Modern Warfare 2 were one-man army in UMP 45 and some of the overpowered kill streaks and overpowered two accurate guns <laughs> now black ops yes they're coming out with patches every other fucking week but still I mean I was playing today for a couple hours and I must have got kicked out of 40 fucking matches because the match I don't know if it's a matchmaking server or whatever the hell it is or migrating host fucking thing that they got going it, it used to be fine but something happened all of a sudden and every time it fucking migrates it'll go back into the game it'll migrate again and everyone gets kicked that's why I st like slowed down playing black ops because that shit pisses me off to the fullest so there's one problem with that <laughs> Another problem would be, I mean, they nerfed the FAMAS, apparently. The Commando, in my eyes, is it's a good, really good gun. I use it, but 
I think that's kind of noobish too, because I mean it's 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 more accurate than the uh, FAMAS, and it's a lot more damage for my personal use, at least. So, Commando, I mean, it's not a problem, but the FAMAS was a problem. They fixed it. Like I said, they, they've been coming out with patches <laughs> every other week on little shit. They, what they need to fix is the big stuff, like, I, I don't know if it's the matchmaking server, but whatever it is, the mi migrating host problem they have, and I don't know if it's just me, but apparently it's not because when I when when I get kicked the whole the whole lobby gets kicked like it'll migrate go back into the game migrate blah 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 so that's one thing they definitely need to fix so out of all of the call of duties from COD 4 to Black Ops I would have to say my favorite is COD 4 all around nothing really overpowered very good game and I'm really looking forward to Modern Warfare 3 because I like Infinity Ward a lot more than Treyarch, so I guess we'll see how Infinity Ward uh, rebounds from Modern Warfare 2. But thank you guys for watching. Please uh, leave a comment and a rating. I finished 11 and 1. Get it.